Now going over to question 22. Here we're being told that M is the original price of a mirror. And we're being told that V is the original price of a vase. So right now, after writing those out, we can easily say M plus V has to be 60 because the original price combined was 60. So now the question is telling us that if for that M for the mirror, if we discount it 25%, well, what number are we going to have here? Now, here's how you can think of increasing or decreasing something by a percent. You start at 100, because percents are different than other numbers, they start at 100, and then you can add or subtract from there, giving you, in my example, 125 or 75. Now, both of those in decimal form are 1.25, are 0.75. So in other words, if I want to raise something 25%, I'm going to multiply it by 1.25. And if I'm going to and if I'm going to lower something by 25%, I'm going to multiply it by 0.75. So coming back here, the mirror is being discounted 25%. So that's 0.75. And the vase is being mo and the vase is being discounted by forty five percent. So let's just so let's just draw a diagram for that. If you start at a hundred percent and you go up or down by forty five from there. It's going to take you up to 145% or down to 55%. And in decimal form, this would be 1.45 and this would be 0.55. Because to go from percent to decimal form, you move the decimal two spaces left. Because to go from percent to decimal form, you move the decimal two spaces left. So if we're discounting it 45%, that means we're multiplying it by 0.55. And the discounted price, the combined sale price for these is 39. So we have 0.75M plus 0.55V equals 39. That matches this one right here. And M plus V is 60, which also matches so the answer for 22 is C.